welcome to a brand new vlog. I decided like spur of the moment this morning that I'm gonna do a little day in my life video. Yeah, so let me just quickly tell you guys what's going on. I just got dressed, did my makeup and hair in this fun little style, I really like it. And I'm getting ready to head to Comic-Con. Today is Sunday, December 4th. Fourth, and it's the third and last day of comic-con I made the last few hours of it yesterday because a few filmmaker and actor friends of mine had a short film premiere at comic-con and then they had a panel too so I wanted to like catch the tail end of that I had some stuff going on earlier in the day so I was only able to catch the tail end but that was really fun didn't vlog at all yesterday just kind of wanted to be present and everything and also there was just too much going on but Today I'm vlogging, so come with me to Comic-Con, you guys. We're just gonna explore, might meet up with a friend or two, we'll see. Um, I got this collar at Comic-Con yesterday, you guys. It was $15, I'm like obsessed with it, oh my god. Also guys, I am not at my apartment or my girlfriend's apartment. I'm actually cat-sitting. I've been cat-sitting for the past few weeks. Every other night, I'm staying at an apartment in downtown LA, and I'm basically cat-sitting this cat that lives here because her owner's are out of town and they've been out of town for the past few weeks luckily they've they're totally okay with my girlfriend Owen staying here with me as well so I don't have to be by myself and I don't have to be like away from her because I would hate that <laughs> so yeah that's kind of a little bit of what I've been up to um, but anyway guys let's head to comic-con actually no first let's do a fit check <laughs> Hello, you wanna be in my fit check? This coat is such a vibe. I got it from Forever 21. Come here. Come here. I got it from Forever 21. It was 40 bucks, guys. It's like a cropped uh, bomber jacket or whatever you call it. Um, my girlfriend was saying it's kind of impractical, but like it's more of a statement coat and I love it so much. I wore it to Comic-Con yesterday, got a few compliments. Nobody's shocked that this is the purse I'm using today, right? I'm obsessed with pink if you guys cannot tell. This is my Comic-Con badge. I got an industry badge. I applied as an actor and I got approved for one, so that's exciting. Same thing happened a few years ago. And then also, almost forgot, these are the earrings I'm gonna wear. I love these, they're like perfect for Comic-Con. They're like gamer girl vibes, right? Earrings are on, you guys. So happy. Also, these were $5 at a queer event I went to last month. Hey, I'm leaving. Goodbye. Huh? A rising star? Yeah. Hopefully, yeah. Inside of the convention center as you guys can see and basically I'm gonna go upstairs to the main hall and check out Artist Alley and all the comic stands and everything like that so let's go this is the main hall and as you can see it's very overwhelming in the best way then pretty much everywhere you look there is awesome nerdy stuff being sold and I want to buy everything. Jackal from 13 Ghosts. Give it up, the Jackal! It's Chris. 
Congratulations. And a congratulations to every one of you That's kids. You'll all be going What's home. Up? I'm vlogging. Oh, you are? Okay, yeah. yeah. No, this place is like wild. This is awesome. I can't believe I'm I like I can't believe I'm here right now. This is like no. Oh my so god. Cool. Super cool seeing my friend Chris. He's gonna go to the video game part and play some games. I'm gonna keep looking around here. Got some really nerdy stickers. I wanna do some Christmas shopping. Um, yeah, just gonna keep looking around. Oh my, oh, oh my goodness. One of the stands here sells lightsabers. Every time I see it, I get so tempted. They had these R2 keychains for $3 and the guy just gave me one as a Christmas gift. How nice is that? I think this is gonna be a gift for my dad, but we'll see. I got some fun stuff. I'll show you guys later. The time has come to leave. There's only 10 minutes left of the con. Stop is 7th Street Metro Center in downtown LA. Okay, so left Comic Con. I'm in downtown LA. The plan now is to grab something to eat and some boba from my new favorite place that I'm going to show you guys. Choice of food is Starbucks grilled cheese. And drink of choice is Rose Cafe Latte with boba inside. All right, so I've come back to the apartment where I'm doing cat sitting to grab my stuff and then I'm gonna head back home. Um, but first guys, oh my gosh, this is so good. I wanna get it every day. Anyway, the plan for the rest of today or tonight is basically, I'm gonna do some editing when I get back to my place check my mailbox and stuff and then tonight I'm going out with my girlfriend Owen and then possibly my friend Claire possibly a few of Owen's friends and we're going to this really fun place no cameras are allowed in there so I'm not gonna vlog any of that but I'm looking forward to going out tonight all right let's taste this god I wish you guys could taste it it's so freaking good I don't know what it is and then to have a drink this good and then on top of it on top of that, there's a boba in it too. Ugh. Obsessed. Bye from now. We'll see you tomorrow. Okay, so I'm back home and I'm gonna show you guys what I got at Comic Con. I basically just got a few little things more on the affordable side. This Star Wars tote bag was $2. How could I not get it? An author was giving away bookmarks with, uh, I guess, images from his newly released sci-fi fantasy book that sounded really, really interesting, actually. I don't know how to say that, but that's what it is. These are also going to be a Christmas present. They're like earrings with little wings on them. Oh, I got something for myself. I almost didn't, but then I thought, you know what? I think this will bring me joy and it's been a while since I've bought a new pair of glasses. You know, the kind that look like seeing glasses, but they're not. They're so pretty. Thank goodness. $15. <laughs> okay, and then lastly, there's this one stand selling stickers for $1 with all of these pop culture characters. So I got a Toph one. Me and my entire family are obsessed with Avatar The Last Airbender, so I got a Katara one. A few of these are going to be gifts, but some of them are for me. I might use them on my laptop. There's Aang. Got two Katara ones. A little Azula one. A little Sokka. 
There were some really good Sokka and Aang cosplays there today too. A little Totoro. Oh my gosh, a little no face. Yeah, that's pretty much everything I got, I think. Good morning slash afternoon for me and my bedhead. <laughs> have a cup of coffee here. I thought I would just hop on and properly end the vlog. Um, hope you guys enjoyed coming along for like a small, a very small piece of Comic-Con. There's so much more to Comic-Con than just the main hall and everything. There are panels and such um, that I didn't really attend many of those, but yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed seeing a little bit. So my next video is probably going to be like a sit down, chatty, life update, kind of like let's catch up type of video, which I rarely do and maybe I should do more often. I don't really know. I like it when other YouTubers I follow do that kind of video and I figured it would be cool to just like do a sit down, chatty video, just sharing like some things that are going on in my life and uh, like a few big things, a few little things. I recently... Well, tomorrow it's going to kind of become more official, but I've reached a major acting career milestone that is like every actor's goal when moving out here, and I'll talk more about that in that video, and uh, yeah, a few other big things like that. <laughs>